Hello traders, this is Chris from AAAFX taking a look at the Dow Jones 30. The Dow Jones initially fell during Friday's trading session to reach that crucial 36,000 level. However, I'll switch to the hourly chart, you can see that's where we stopped selling off. Jobs number came out a little hotter than anticipated, but there's a lot of internal numbers that people said, okay, well, maybe it's not as strong as we think, and possibly we get that sugar rush coming out of the Federal Reserve. That's essentially what Wall Street's banking on right now is loose monetary policy. A stronger economy is actually the last thing Wall Street wants, and that's what this run-up's been all about. It's been about falling yields. So with that in mind, it'll be interesting to see how the next several days come into play. Keep in mind, the Federal Reserve has an interest rate decision and perhaps more important uh, than that will be the press conference uh, next uh, week. And uh, I believe that is uh, Wednesday. And that will obviously have a big effect on the market. That being said, yields down, stocks up. That's kind of been the play for a while. I don't see that changing. If we can break above the Wednesday high here, then we can start to have conversations about trying to reach the highs over here at about 37,000. I do think eventually we get there, but this time of year does tend to be very noisy. We are overbought. We, we really should see more of a pullback. But there may be traders out there chasing performance, and that might be part of what's propelling this. Certainly can't sell the market at the moment. Um, I've got a couple lever, uh, levels that I'm watching. 36,000 was one of them, uh, 35,700 the other. Right now, the momentum is to the upside. Certainly can't fight that. Uh, but maybe, you know, maybe you'll get lucky and you get a little bit of a pullback uh, that you can buy into using this as uh, a little bit of a backboard. I would not expect massive moves on Monday, though, just because we're waiting for not only the Fed, there's a whole, ha there's like PPI on Wednesday, uh, CPI on Tuesday, and you've got the Swiss, the British, the ECB, and the Fed with interest rate decisions next week. So it's going to be a very, very choppy week. Uh, Monday could be quiet. I would be a little surprised if the bulls came out and just drove this thing higher. Hey, 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 yes.